Hi everyone. For Steam Next Fest, February 2024, I played the Dual Corp demo, developed by Dream Effect Entertainment. Dual Corp is an action RPG with clear inspiration taken from Souls games. You wander around a map filled with enemies, slaying them and accumulating equipment and resources you can use to advance your character. The game has bosses, which end up being an incredibly challenging and grueling affair, which you're expected to do over and over to eventually master their mechanics. The demo said up front that there was no plot or story, and this will not be the game loop in the full game, so the review here is a little tricky. Full disclosure, I'm not a fan of Souls games. Gameplay is very reminiscent of a Souls game, but it's obviously not polished. Movement feels less deliberate, less precise, and I didn't feel it was very rewarding when you actually pull off a cool move. I did die a lot during the beginning tutorial section, and that mirrors my experience with the first Dark Souls, but I never had an aha moment in Dual Corp. There was never a moment where you realize you're supposed to run past the Asylum Demon. It just felt frustrating to go through, and there wasn't a payoff at the end. This game definitely isn't concerned about being fair, but perhaps that's par for the course for Souls games. Inventory and RPG elements weren't really meaningfully present in the demo, at least not in a way that mattered. One thing that's quite different is the presence of other players. Echoes of other playthroughs are present in your game, and you can watch them run into walls, go in circles, or maybe they'll fight mobs for you. This mechanic did feel a bit strange to me, to be honest, like I was playing an MMO. I'm intrigued to see where it goes, but for now I'm not sure what to think of it. And by the way, no echoes are present during the boss fight. The demo map is atrocious. The setting is in an outdoor forest, which suggests an open space, but the demo was cluttered with small hills that were completely impassable, making it maze-like. Figuring out where you can and can't go was more of a challenge than it needed to be, and getting lost was easy. The maps also weren't very inspiring, nor were they very large. I'm not a fan of the graphics. Normally, I like pixely graphics. I feel like they have a lot of room for charm and style, but these don't feel like they evoke that. They feel like a 3D model that's been converted. The details look a little blurry, and it's easy for things to blend together. Now that said, these graphics are more than serviceable, and this is an early access demo, so maybe this isn't even a fair criticism, and this is all just a work in progress. Would I recommend Dual Corp? No, but with two caveats. First, I'm not a fan of Souls games, so this was never going to grab me. Your mileage may vary if you are a fan of Souls games. Second, this is obviously an incomplete look at the full game, so as work continues on this game and polish gets added, maybe these issues will be ironed out. Issues like the controls needing some refinement, preferably making them more responsive, map design needs to be vastly improved, I think the graphics could use a bit of polish, and if the game is going to be punishing like a Souls-like, it also needs to be rewarding like a Souls-like. I'd be curious what people who actually like Souls games think of this, but at the very least, this is definitely not for me. Thank you for watching, let me know what you think in the comments.